Hey cuties, welcome back to my channel. I wanted to show you a close-up of the unit after I had put my finishing touches on it and cut it so here it is close view of it this hair is really beautiful I do highly recommend it for the fall and winter cute okay see you soon Welcome back to my channel. This is Cute Little Voice. I'm glad to see that you came back to visit. So today's wig will be on this gorgeous wig right here. But let me just say happy Friday to everyone out there. Hope you're having a beautiful and blessed day. So today's wig again is another one of a curly wig for you guys. Um, for my fall affordable curly um, wig series. And I hope you have been enjoying this series so far. I have much more in store for you cuties. So um, this is a wig that is very, very gorgeous. And I do recommend this wig right off the back. So this wig is from Red Carpet Premiere Collection. Lace, uh, silk lace. Uh, it is called RCP605. That's the style, RCP605. And I have it in a color ST4 slash 30. So you're getting four right up in this area throughout the perimeter of the wig. And then you also have a 30 at the bottom, which is very, very pretty. I love the way that this wig is constructed as far as the color goes because it is very, very nice. And the colors intertwine very well. Now you do get a L-shaped parting with this unit um and it is swiss lace so the lace on this wig is very very soft so you're getting lace from ear to ear um it lifts a little bit but you can go ahead and use some gorilla snot to lay your edges down and just kind of blow dry it afterwards but um the parting is a nice part so it's pretty wide starting here and ending all the way down here pretty generous amount of parting now if you don't like big hair ladies um you can always customize the unit but if you just don't want to buy it i wouldn't recommend it because it is very big coming straight out the package um let me give you a 360 as is because i am going to go ahead and put some layers in it so here's the front Okay, so yes, this hair is voluminous, ladies, again, and it did come with three combs, three around the perimeter, one, two, three, one in the back, which makes four, and you get your adjustable straps. The cap is a medium cap. I would say it's not, um, it's not really large and it's not really small. I think this cap will fit just about any head, um, so yes, so um, I'm going to go ahead and trim some of this hair just to give me a little bit of layers because as you guys know my face is really small and round and I do have to manipulate this wig into how I want it so I'm just going to take a little bit of hair and I might be looking in my mirror over to my right so excuse me so I'm just going to cut a little bit off As you can see, that gave me a little bit more layers. And I'm going to go ahead and cut just a little bit more. I don't know if I need to. Let me see. Um, 
I'm gonna start over here and cut. You wanna always cut downward. You don't wanna cut um, too much off and you don't wanna cut straight across cause that will make the wig look unnatural. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut again. So there, I kind of put some layers in there. And I think that better frames my face. I'm gonna take a little bit more off right in here. And I'm gonna take a little a little from here off. So yes, um, I'm really feeling it now. I really did like it before, but Again, you do have to customize your wigs to how you like them. If you like them coming straight out the package, that's also fine. But I want my wigs to look um, more, you know, um, framed to my face. So, yes, ladies, let's get more into this unit. You can curl this unit up to, uh, let's see, it doesn't really say, but it is Futura heat resistant fiber, so you can curl it. Um, I wouldn't recommend that you curl this hair because it already comes like really tightly curled as you can see. I love the curls. It's like really, really pretty and defined. As far as the luster on this wig, the luster is a very, very low luster. You don't get a sheen. It looks very, very natural. This hair texture is a yakky texture. Um, it does have a light silk to it though. Um, and again, the density is very, very full. So if you don't like big hair, again, do not get this wig. Um, now, it has an example on this board that shows you the difference between regular lace and silk lace. In my opinion, silk lace looks a little bit more natural than regular lace. And so here is the regular lace. As you can see, the knots are very, very visible. And you can just see all the knots and everything like that. And the wig that I have on today has silk lace and it just has like a scalpage appearance which looks really, really natural. Now with the regular lace, you can always go in and add powder as well as add powder to the silk lace. And it will both look natural, but this one looks a little bit more natural. So yes, that's the difference between Swish and French lace. So, um, yes, cuties, that is about all for this unit. I'm trying to see if I left anything out. Okay, let me just tell you about the colors before I go. Um, it has colors 1, 1B, 2, blue black, 1B, 30, F430, purple black, um, red velvet, and also this color, which is a ST430. I did get this wig from GlamourTress.com. So if you want to check out their site, I'll leave it right here. And also, um, it did come with tape on the back right here, about five pieces of tape. I don't recommend that you use the tape. It is just you know too much i think it will tear out your edges but yes ladies um let me give you one more 360 side cuties i'm out of here and i do appreciate you for watching make sure you thumbs up like comment and subscribe Bye -bye.